So, uh, my bell. Um, look, uh, you've had some pretty popular, uh, TV shows in the past. Um, uh, The Punisher, Daredevil, uh, Luke Cage, uh, Jessica, whatever her last name was. Yeah, pretty popular. Yeah, Marvel's season to S.H.I.E.L.D., that's pretty popular too. And, uh, yeah, your movies are doing pretty well, yeah. Yeah, you guys have, uh, pretty much good movies coming out, huh? You guys are not gonna pay attention to some of the most popular characters ever, huh? Yeah, you guys are just gonna forget that you guys never wanted to do Spider-Man because Sony and Disney are too busy killing him on the pizzas, huh? You're not gonna ignore the fact that your most famous heroine doesn't have a movie or TV series yet, huh? Oh, you think I'm joking about that? <laughs> Run! This, yes, Marvel's Miss Marvel's, or Kamala Khan, is one of the most, if not the most, if not the popular char female character that comes from Marvel. Besides Squirrel Girl. Come on, we all know that she's the best superhero ever. So, Camera Khan can be a great setup for a movie or a TV series. If you read the comics or if you're reading the comics, then you already know what I mean. She has such a great character. She's very well admired. She's very well respected. She's in the Avengers cartoon series, like a couple of episodes, I think, or maybe just one episode. And it was great to see her in there. But the problem is, is that you have other heroes that are like, that, like, nobody really paid attention much to. And then you have some of these other heroes. Like, the last movie, Captain Marvel? Not a lot of people have heard of her! So, we have Ms. Marvel, Kamala Khan, who I believe is from India, is your most famous character, but you're not gonna do anything about it! Let's discuss what could have, what we could do with Miss Marvel. Number one, she has a great background, she has a great character development, she has amazing superpowers, and it'd be well done in a TV series or a movie. But no, in every weather, make shit jokes and fucking not even pay attention to the character's actual origin story. It's not flawed, Marvel. Your character. I mean, I know that you're owned by Disney, and Disney's a little bit. Yeah. Um. But your your character, Miss Marvel, she's not flawed. She's one of the most popular and well known female superheroes in the world next to Wonder Woman. That's a big accomplishment. Even when she was first released selling millions of, of comics, she was reaching world renownability. That's pretty hype. So here's the thing, you can make Miss Marvel into a good TV series. She has a great character development, she has great side characters, she has great villains that we can pay attention to and know about. So, what's holding you back? Come on, get with the program. Doug Groovin, Doug Groovin, Doug making my Marvel. So let me know what you guys think about Miss Marvel in the comment section down below. Do you want to see Miss Marvel or do you not want to see Miss Marvel? Let me know. Also guys, just a little quick announcement here. I'm going to be doing three videos a week, two times on those dates, and those days are going to be Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, those are going to be my three major dates, and that's what I'm going to be doing, so, um, once, you know, after these ones get released, then it's, it's going to be basically Monday, Wednesday, and, uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday content, so thank you guys so much for watching, be sure to join the Lazy Universe via Twitter, and by subscribing, like the video, and if you want to see more, let me know in the comments section down below, so thank you guys so much for, very much for watching, and Marvel, Make Miss Marvel a movie! Make Miss Marvel a movie! Make Miss Marvel a movie! Make Miss Marvel a movie!